Hello, this is Indirish Karai. Welcome back to another episode of Feed the Beast Horizons mod pack. Last time I left off, I was going to work on uh, golems, I think, but actually I'm here in my uh, winter uh, guardian area because I wanted to yeah, create a tainted area. Uh, this uh, node right here is tainted. Give me a sec. Yep, and that's because there's a taint, a p actually a tainted node over there that spawned, you know, on World Gen. I put this one next to it, so it tainted this one, and I tainted that node in there, and that node in there. I'm actually gonna see if I can spread all the creep over there and see if that node in there will be able to make the creep spread everywhere, because I want to have a place where I can get a lot of taint from. <coughs> so. While we're doing our episode, that chunk loader will keep that already chunk loaded, and hopefully the taint will slowly spread. Yeah, mainly you want things like this for taint. Just getting close. And there we go. And I think these only last 45 seconds in your inventory before they will uh, apply the taint effect to you and be destroyed. So you need to have a bag or something to put them in, a chest, or use magic mirrors to send them back to your base. And yeah, here's my uh, winter guardian area. I set up a containment field. Yeah, I had to actually dig up the snow because it wouldn't activate with the snow there. I probably should have just done this. But now if I summon him, he gets stuck in there. As long as I uh, stay pretty close. Ooh, this note, I'll have to taint that one as well. And I found out how to fuel my jetpack. But first things first. I don't know if you can upgrade the upgraded jetpack. Bedrock armor. Oh, pff, I'm making the wrong place. Wish those would be quieter. That's why I have those mufflers there. There we go. I think we can just combine these. Ah, uh, it probably needs the uh, work table. Yeah, there we go. So you have the armor and that, and to actually fuel it. How do you fill the tank on it? No, not a filler. What was that thing called? It, it made perfect sense when I read the name. Oh, I'm gonna move away from all that noise. No. Fuel, no. Fill? What's it called? I'll grab the book and see if I can find it again. I remember what it looks like. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Nope. Yeah, somewhere around here. Here it is. Oh, filling station, yeah. And it only needs 1024 watts of power. So I'm probably going to use a DC engine. I think I'll put it right... Oh, these are my more machines right here. Why, why will that muffler not work all the time? Ugh. How's my power doing? It's filling back up. Ah, I'm out of algae. No wonder. Maybe we should put it there, or...? Hmm. Because I wanted to automate the ethanol crystals going into it, then maybe I will put it over here. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Can't break with that. Oh, shoot. not mean for that to happen. I wanted to put it right above here. Let's see. Ah. Yeah, maybe 
maybe there is a bad idea. Hmm. I could put it right there. No. Yes? No. Could have one single chest for it all. If I should do that, take this and move it right above there. Hmm. Need to do something to get this working. first that I don't need. Yeah, chuck that in there. Okay. Nope. You are deactivated. Excellent. Where's my actual axe? Thank you. <coughs> now will things be sent into here? what I want to know. Going through there. Yes, there are. So if I break this chest... Nope. Oh! Where are those items? Where are those items coming from? Oh, from the other... I could just put a blocker right there. Have it going up and over and down. Hmm. But for now, what I really need to do... There we go. Okay, empty in a second. Excellent. There you go, that should work fine. Oh. I have to actually get rid of this. If I had it up and over, then it wouldn't work out too well, though. Ugh. Unless... Yes, there's nothing right there. Perfectly. Ah, uh, where are you? And the wrench. There we go. And now I need it. Oh, where is did I put that? Well, I don't need you or you. And okay, cover. We will have it on this side. Yes. Uh, Plus item duct. Oops. There we go. Oh, nothing went in there. Nope. Yeah, it wouldn't have automatically exported, I don't believe. Everything is looking nice. Yeah, there we go. Fix this, move this over. Now I'll be able to set this up. The engine. Oh. Needs to be aimed the other way around. Put that away. Take this out. Oh, I 
any lever. And a muffler. I'll put you there, you there. Now, question is if I put you there, will that work? Can't see if it's running. So I'm gonna pop down there. I hope it is. Yes, excellent. Uh, I never actually made the filling station. I need four liquid pipes and impeller. Pipes, impeller. Thank you, mufflers. Steel reservoir, base. That's so loud. Come on, mufflers. There you go. Actually shows... Hmm. I wonder if I have to equip it or something else. Uh, I do need an export bus. Just a basic one. Do little thing. Well, it'll pop out soon. So loud. My two. Okay. If it's right in front, then I only need it here. Here's sound and hopefully. Oh, yeah, and I move this over here. Don't know if I showed that last episode. Nope. Export bus. And ethanol crystals. Oops, that's not what I wanted. I forgot that wasn't there. I was cooking them down. I put this here. <laughs> Filling right up. Wow, it cooks those really fast. I wonder how many millibuckets this can hold. And do I have the wand on me? fine. And there we go. Filling station complete. But back to the golems. First thing I'm going to actually do is finish making another brain in a jar. I've made two. Let me show you how you make those. I'm actually going to show you here. You need a brain, the Thomcraft brain, an eye, another eye, and a bucket. So brain on top, two eyes on the sides, bucket on the bottom and give it a tap and you'll see what Essentia needs. It needs 10 Cognitio, 10 Census, and 20 Examinus. 
Oh, and uh, warded chair in the middle. How hard is this supposed to be? I think it was alchemy. Artifice? Yeah, brain and jar. Moderate. <laughs> yeah, this hasn't even sparked once. And we get the bucket back. I actually like that. Well, even if it consumed the bucket, I probably wouldn't have really cared. Okay, the reason we want these is because I want to upgrade some of my golems, and that is going to be tough. But actually, more importantly, yeah, we're going to skip... Ignore that for a bit. Upgrading the golems isn't that huge a deal. Ugh, I still need to do a lot more research. Get away from the loud sounds. What I want to make is golemancy. Use, yes. I need an empty core. Five lucrum, five void. How much lucrum do I have? Oh, vacuous, not void. Lucrum. Oh, got plenty of that. That's a use. I wonder if one will be enough. Yeah, it's only like a waste of three. Christi Victus Viniculum. I don't have any vacuos. That's why I like being able to look it up all in here. What would be chests? Give four. Those are pretty easy. Uh, what else is there? Chemists give four, five, five. Ferris? Definitely not using that, though. Hopper. I have plenty of iron. How much wood planks do I have? That could be a question. Maybe air seeds? Huh. Yeah, I actually planted earth, air, water, and fire seeds. I'm trying to uh, get all my crops going. I think we'll just go for regular chests. Yeah, I planted a bunch of trees soon. Fourteen. Sixteen, if they give each four, this should be enough for quite a stack. Yeah, I put these all here just for... I don't know why I put it in the top. But oh well, in they go. Start cooking up. What else? Oh, I get Arbor. That'll just be gotten rid of. That. Uh, where's Vacuos? Should be toward the end here. Yeah, I, I uh, may have started to make them alphabetical. Please don't judge me. But the one I'm missing is that one there. I have a worded jar for that, actually. Because, uh... Nope, other one. Uh, how many? They give three. There we go. Once those go through, I will have every one in alphabetical order. Yes, I am that <laughs> OCD sometimes. Um, plus, just it, honestly, in my defense, it does make it a lot easier to find things. So it's not that bad. We need some cores. I wonder if I have any empty ones. Yes, we'll take you. Uh, Lucrum. And vacuos. Good, nothing came out. Uh, good, now we have empty. What's the next stage? Use. Comparator, lever, flint, shears. Oh, it's an infusion. Did I teach 
teach you how to make a comparator. Nope. No, you do. I doubt the broken one will work. Wait, didn't I have a pair of iron shears somewhere? Yeah. And I think I need a lever? And... There we go. Okay, you go in the middle. Comparator goes in the top. We'll go for the one on the right. Lever, flint, shears. Lever, flint and steel, and shears. And what did it need again? 20 Humanus, 20 Instrumentum, 20 Machina. Let's see, Instrumentum. They're all moved around. Instrumentum, check. I need to move that out of that jar, though. Instrumentum Humanus. Humanus. Ooh, I need more of that. And Machina. Ooh, we got plenty of that. Oh, for the extra, I need a place to put it. Oh, Humanus, I think we just use zombie brains for that. Yeah. Sure, low. We'll just put an entire stack in there. Uh, wait, what's in there? There should be metallum in there. Oh, metal. Wait, Machina was over here, so Metallum should be. Why is Lucrum gone? Oh. Lucrum must be filled up too. Come on, you know what? We want, we want to get into there. Yes, there we go. Actually, I wonder if this will work. Nope. Oh well. I'll just remake, remake that later. Actually, I'll just remake that now while I'm waiting for the Humanist to cook up. any more of those labels. Don't need you. Don't need you. Can put you back. There we go. Everything nicely and neatly labeled. How's my Humanus coming along? 29. Excellent. Let's give this a little love tap and see what happens. first. Probably should have made a couple extras just in case. But it's been doing pretty well. What's the instability on this? Oh, minor, yeah. The other one was moderate. This one should hopefully work fine. And then Humanus. No sparking, good sign. Comparator, then it'll probably be this. Or maybe not. Oh, wait, yeah, there it is. Then shields, shears, and then a lever. Excellent. We have the use. And now, what else do we need? 
We will need a golem for this, but that shouldn't be too bad. Zombie jerky? Huh, I'll have to look at that. What was the other core that we needed? Golem core chop, which of course is going to need this one. Messis and Meto. Messis. Might as well put all of these back until I actually need them. Meto. What? I don't have any Meto? Okay, I guess we'll keep these on me. Where Meto should be, right? Oh, there we go. Good enough. And a blank core. Because I want to have one golem uh, planting trees and one golem chopping them down. And another golem picking up everything. Nessus Meto. Please work. There we go. Yeah, that'll be fine. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, um... Oh, and how do I upgrade this to chop? I'm guessing another infusion? Ooh, I, I need an axe in the stream for this, really? I'm guessing I don't have a spare one. Nope, so I'm gonna need to make one. You've already, uh, seen... seen me make one of these before. water, a diamond, and great wood log. Okay, that isn't as bad as I thought it would be. Ah, damn, loud engines. Okay, you go in the middle. Uh... Check out that recipe again quickly. Diamond on the bottom, great wood log on the left. Diamond on the bottom, great wood log on the left. And then the two water shards. I should make the other. Did I make everything? Can't remember. Ah, uh, A, aqua. I have plenty of that and way too much arbor. I wonder what the difficulty on this was. That's minor. Negligible. Okay, it should be over quickly. Yep, it's just absorbing everything. You go on the top and the right and the bottom. Yeah, I don't know why it's doing that. Harvest. Double check. Uh, arbor check. 15 instrumentum, 15 meta. Close, but check. And check. It should be over quickly. Now, what golems should I use for this? Or do I have any spare golems, actually? Shoot, there's a timer. I have... I guess I'll just use flesh for now. Oh yeah, because the flesh were what I was going to upgrade. Ah, there we go. Chop. And I 
actually want to look this up. What? Stronger golems will chop them down faster. Okay, what's a really good strong golem? Strength high. Strength high. Above average. I think I might go for a thomium. They're slow, but the trees won't be growing that fast, and I'd rather just have the trees being chopped down faster. Plus, I've never actually made a thomium golem before. Mana Smotus Spiritus. That should be too hard. Uh, Humanus. Smotus. Spiritus. And make that Thaumium block. Oh. Need to make more Thaumium. This should have zero waste, I believe. There we go. Thaumium Golem. Now, where should I set this guy up, though? I'm afraid if I put him too close here, he will go for the these. What is his range? I think they have short ranges, like the other one's four. So if it's space, one, two, three, four, there. One, two, three, four. There. I'm going to set him up right here. There we go. I'm going to take out my uh, Tinker Spell just in case. Doesn't seem to be going for. Oh! I really don't like you guys. Yeah, I think I gained a bit of level since. Another one! Gain a bit of level since last time. Hopefully they don't go up from tree to tree. And now I need a... I'll just use a Flesh Golem for now. They're fast. So I'll probably end up using a Tallow. Actually, I actually need a chest. I'll put you... Okay, the, uh, use. Okay, and the bell. Who should you use this item on a block or only on an empty location? Take a stack of these, but... Block. See if I tell you to Okay, now if I put saplings in here. Yes, it works. I was hoping it being I could configure him to somehow only, uh, maybe I need an order upgrade. I'll look into this, see if I can uh, find a way of configuring him to use different saplings in different areas. But I'm going to end that episode here. If you like, like, subscribe. If you don't, don't. But I hope you'll see you next episode. Take care.